Hi bestie, welcome to my channel. My name is Miss Frugal, also known as Karen. In this video, I'm going to change out my cash wallet. If this is something that interests you, hopefully you decide to stay until the end. So I had my A7 Green Binder Wallet Planner for a few years now. Um, but a few weeks ago, the coins were just all over the place. So I purchased the same planner wallet binder again a few weeks ago it's here you see right now the coins are just busting loose they're busting loose again and you know i'm kind of irritated with it so i need to go ahead and change wallets now the two wallets that i have to change right now are black and i did go ahead and order a different design in green which should be here soon. I ordered it. I think I ordered it last night or the day before. But until then, let me go ahead and swap out this one for another one. So guys, I was being extremely frugal when I purchased this binder right here because it's dirt cheap. And sometimes it's not to be, it's not good to be frugal. You know, it's, it makes a difference with the quality. And because I was being frugal, this is what I get. And that's why sometimes you have to purchase things at a higher price, a higher dollar value for the quality of it. And it's crazy because my daughter and I was talking about it this morning. Um, cause the guy was like, he don't understand why I want to buy high, high-end purses now some people do buy it for the name brand and they love it but one thing about high brand if something happened if this was my lv wallet i just called my advisor and they would handle it for me whereas something like this i would have to keep purchasing something over and over if something happens to it so sometimes it just doesn't pay to be frugal uh, but I tried. So hopefully this um, binder that I'm about to switch to will work until I get my new binder. And of course, neither one of them are still not high end, but we shall see. We shall see. So these are the two A7 binders that I have. And... Oh, I see. So I've been debating buying me an Epi Leather LV PM planner for my cash envelope system, but I'm trying to be frugal. So I got these, um, knockoff look Epi Leather A7 binders. Now, if they do not last and do not work, I'm going to have to invest in something with better quality. And if something happened to it, I don't have to buy another one. I just contact my um Elvado. I just contact not Elvado, Oscarvado, which is my LV advisor, and he will get me straight. So we're gonna see if this will last until twenty twenty five. Because maybe the green one didn't. And when I said I utilized the green binder for a few years now. Well, I've had it for a few years. Was I actually using it? I used it when I first got it a couple of years ago, and it's just been sitting in a bin. And once I decided to do the cash wallet, that's when I brought the binder out. And, I mean, it was in my purse, and I don't use it all the time because I don't spend like that. I don't go out like that. Um, So we're going to see. But regardless, I never really use it like that. When I put the coins in there and they just bust out the um wallet, binder, planner, whatever you want to call it, it's a problem. But we're going to see. But if these don't work, I'm going to go get what I want. And I've been trying to be for a while. I've been trying my best not to get that LV agenda. But if these doesn't work out, I think I will go ahead and get what I want. It's not what I need. But for me, I don't like um, buying products that do not last. I'm not used to that. I'm not accustomed to it. So we're going to see. We're going to see. 
Now, I do think both of these planners are absolutely beautiful. I love the rose gold hardware along with this gold hardware. Both of them look so beautiful with the black. It's just stunning. Um, the simplicity of this um, gold and black. It's absolutely beautiful. But time will tell once I start utilizing to see what it stands the test of time. For the quality. Because typically on the agenda since I've been planning. I haven't had any issues out of all of them. So far I haven't. Um, I think this is my first time where I ever had an issue with a planner. But we shall see. I don't think I'm going to keep this planner card right here. I think I'm going to change out. I think I either want... I'm either going to add a black planner card or a money or financial quote planner card that I have to place in that ID holder spot. Because I don't think I like that right there. But right now, I'm also looking for some full budget finance stickers. I need them for my sinking funds binder. Now, I've been searching on the internet for the past three days, trying to find exactly what I'm looking for. And I haven't found exactly, well, I have seen some things I like, but it's overseas. It's overseas. And I'm not sure if anyone in the community, do you make custom full stickers for cash envelopes? And if you do, and if you know someone who does that, can you leave that information in the comments so I can support them in their small business? Because I, I want full, I want gold full, I want to buy a different full. Because I need it for my sinking funds binder. But I want full stickers as well as for my blackout budget planner. And I want the transparent full stickers. I want icons. I need full icon budget finance stickers. I'm probably going to have to make some customs of that. Because I do want some categories that I doubt that are available like in any sticker books or any shops. But if you can, just leave that in the information if you know a small business that does custom icons in full. Any, I want gold, silver, azure rose gold, and also white. So I think I'm finished with setting up my new cash wallet for the moment. I think it turned out great. Once I change out the planner card that's in the ID section, I think it'll be perfect. Let me know your thoughts on the setup. And thank you so much for watching my video. Have an awesome day, guys. Toodles.